Shalom. I just wanted to talk real quick about communism and capitalism and the deception that the capitalists have on the minds of the people. Okay. Because it's, it's sad. I was walking in the grocery store the other day and I saw a, a, a throwback newspaper talking about how Kennedy got shot by a pro communist. Okay. A pro communist. So, um, that was used as a scare tactic in those days. Communism is still a scare tactic because the root word of communism is community. Okay, community. People hate communism, so that means you are hating community. Okay. The misunderstanding about communism is, which is told by the capitalists. Okay, is that you won't have your own private property. Okay, you won't have your own anything, which is a complete lie. Okay, communism is what, what communism is is you're working for the people okay every man works for every person okay the bible says are you your brother's keeper okay that's what communism is you, you living and being your brother's keeper and capitalism you live for yourself you don't live for the people you live for yourself and you think you go out and work for yourself but you're actually working for somebody okay people say they're free and they celebrate their independence days and things of this nature when all actuality, in all actuality, all you have the freedom to do is choose who your master is going to be. Okay. What am I talking about? Well, right now you punch the clock, not for yourself, but for your master. Okay. You got the, you got the freedom to choose who you want to work for. Do you want to work for uh, Walmart? Do you want to work for uh, Citibank? Do you want to work for... Bank of America, do you want to work for whatever bank, you understand, or whatever company, okay? People go to school just to work for somebody. You were a slave. Whenever you work for somebody, you were a slave. Name me one animal that works for another animal. That's unnatural, okay? And that's what capitalism is, an unnatural system. Communism is a system where you work together, work for the people, you share things in common. That don't mean you don't have your own personal stuff, but like elect electricity, for example. People gotta work to, because one one company owns electricity, so you gotta pay for that. In a communist state, electricity would be free, because all the people, the, the electricity belongs to the people, okay? The same with food, shelter, etc., etc. But y'all Negroes been brainwashed to love capitalism, and that's why most of y'all <clears throat> are marked with the uh, mark of the beast, okay? Brainwashed. You, you, you serve the beast, okay? Because you love his ways, okay? And, and that's, a, that's, a sad, that's, sad, that's, sad, that's a sad thing, okay? That's a sad thing, okay? But besides that, I just wanted to clear up the misconception of communism. Capitalism is the 1% capitalizing off the masses. And of course, communism is going to be the enemy to capitalism, okay, because capitalism doesn't want people coming together to live. Because if that happened, there would be no more capitalism, okay? So stop being brainwashed. Come about that spell. Come on.